going to be a pretty short video because the purpose of this video is to uh, show or illustrate how you can take a still picture and create like a Harry Potter style animation uh, video. So this is an old picture of my grandfather and my grandmother at some party, right? And they're both, they've been dead for years, probably like 30 years, 40, I don't know, a long time because I'm old. Um, and I uploaded this picture to cleanai.com. And you could do this for, uh, free. You could you could create uh, text the video, image the video, and then you could lip sync also. So I'm going to show you two things. I'm going to I'm going to take a fun video, and then I'm going to create a lip sync from an image too. And I'm going to show you some other ones I did. So this is really cool because because how does AI know that these people are dancing and not hugging each other? It has them dancing real nice. And then uh, the funny thing is, this guy right here, that's kind of weird. I don't know what's going on with the AI. But this guy was dancing with a woman in the picture. See, here's her arms. And the woman just disappears like he's a magician. And then all of a sudden, he starts dancing with my grandparents. So this, I think this is a really great example of, of what this clingai.com can do. So let's go ahead. And uh, I, I want to – this looks like a fun – fun picture. So these are my boys. They're much older now. We were at a, a Star Wars theme thing at the Strong Museum of Play in Rochester, New York, the National Museum of, of uh, Play. So uh, I'm going to upload this picture. I'm going to show you and we're going to animate it. Um, so the first thing is I'll delete that spot. It doesn't delete my videos or any of that stuff. So let's go ahead and pick this uh, picture. And I want to go to my pictures because that's where it is. And um, boo, 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 boo. here it is. Right, here. I think it's this one. Let's see. Let's look around. Yeah. And this will open the picture. Now there's a there's a free version. The free version does the same thing, as far as I know. Um, and when I when I went to do this the first time with the free version, uh, I'm going to click generate. So it's going to generate a like a harry potter style uh animated picture um and we'll see hopefully this comes out good it, it's just like any uh, ai uh sometimes you want to hit generate more than once uh you could see i have uh i have like 661 um this only takes two minutes credits and i get credits generated so so i actually like i was saying i was doing the free version and it said it's going to take three hours to uh, to create the video animation, so I'm like, ah, I'll do the pay version because it only takes two minutes with the with the pay version, not three hours. But you could try it out for free. You can take any pictures you want and click uh, the do all this. All you do is upload. All you do is image the video, upload it, and hit generate, and uh, it'll it'll do everything else for you. Um, you never know what you're going to get for the animation, so sometimes you want to hit generate more than once. Um, the thing with the free version is obviously it takes a long time, and then you get less credits uh, per day or per month, so you can only do it a couple times. But it's a great way to see if you actually want to uh, buy an annual subscription to it. It's like almost 80 bucks for an annual subscription. I just figured this is so much fun. Uh, this, this is one of the things with AI that... I, I always was like, this is the awesomest thing ever because, you know, like I'm saying, this this old picture of my grandparents, all of a sudden it comes to life. It, it's just insane. And I'll show you a, a bunch of other pictures that I animated um, from old from old pictures of uh, my parents and my grandparents on both sides um, and, and my current family. Um, these are my four boys. Um, and like I said, we went to a Star Wars thing, so I saw. I thought that'd be a fun, uh, fun thing. And then after we generate this image, um, I will show you. Here we go. So now it's creating. There it is. Look, it just generated. It doesn't really look like. Doesn't really look like him anymore. But it's because he had his hands over his eyes, so the AI couldn't really figure that out. But uh, but yeah, it, it's a it's a cool image. Uh, I like it. All right, so we'll pause that. And now I'm going to pick uh, an image to lip sync to, to get it to talk. This is fun. So 
this is a, let's see, I'm trying to think. This is a pretty current picture of me. I got a lot more gray in my hair, but this is like from four years ago. So it's not, it's not that bad. So let's go ahead and um, let's generate an animation there. And while, while it's doing that, once again, two minutes, I will show you um, some other ones that I did. All right, so let's go on my Facebook page. Do, do. And all right, so this is my current family. So that's, there's, uh, there's that again. So this was a picture. It's actually a big portrait that's hanging on our wall. Um, and it animated it, animated the hands, uh, the blinks, the smiles. It didn't do that much like it did with the other ones, but these are great. So I'm going to click on this so we can go through these. So that's the picture. That's my grandmother. That's my grandfather. That came from a picture. These, my other grandfather and grandmother. This was a picture. This is a great image too. Uh, this is my grandmother, my uncle, and my dad when he was at Notre Dame College. Uh, like in the 60s. This is my dad cooking Cornell chicken, famous Cornell chicken recipe. My uh, grandfather was a volunteer firefighter, and up north we call it the, uh, they have the chicken barbecue. And Cornell chicken is the official uh, marinade of the fireman's chicken barbecue in upstate New York. And then this is my mom, and then uh, some magician lady who's going to go, she just like makes a magic trick there. I don't know how she did that, but uh, that's cute. She must be dating that guy when she disappeared. This is my grandma, my dad, and my uncle again. Uh, this is his high school graduation. That's the uh, same picture there. So these are all the same pictures there. So so that's uh, that's those. And I could show you it also as uh, it also works uh, for... Um, you could see a video on how to create uh, animations from a selfie. So you can upload a selfie and create a Star Wars animation using the same software type of thing. All right, so here is the picture, and it's not doing anything. So let's do lip sync and see if it'll do the lip sync for us. And I could uh, I could upload uh, my own, I could record my own MP3 or WAV format and then upload it and get it to say something. Uh, but I will do a mail. Uh, let's see. Listen, I know things are tough right now. Nah. Don't worry, sis. I'll help you with your math. Come here, champ. Tell daddy all about your... Yeah. Every time I open a book, it feels like stepping into a new world. Hey, guys. Who's up for a game of basketball after school? In my day, we respected our... The intricate relationship between quantum mechanics and general no, let's relativity do, let's do, is Lord. fascinating. Hey, it's a little it? bit. It's a little bit much. Uh, let's make them happy. You can make them angry, sad, all the rest of it, and uh, we'll do something like um, thank. Oops. Thank you for watching this video tutorial on. How to animate photos. Period. All right, now listen to it. Thank you for watching this video tutorial on how to animate photos. He doesn't sound very happy. Let's see what we got here. Let's do someone else. Sage. Thank you for watching this video. To Thank you for watching this video tutorial on how to animate photos. That sounds better. All right, so now we'll generate this, and this will take only four minutes. And uh, some of these, I'll show you. This one is I got the lip sync on it. It's really oh, I could show you a couple that has lip lip sync on it that I created already using uh, like cartoon animation type thing. Oh, I could do that right. Ten minutes. Okay, let's do that now. So here are some. So this one lip synced really good. On you. May the force of Isaac Newton be upon you. That was from a still image that I created May with the Chat force GPT. Of Isaac Newton. It's supposed to be in my likeness. These are supposed to be like selfies of me. These don't have words, but these are animations uh, that I created from still images. Be upon you. So I created uh, 
I created still images on chat, GPT, and then some other um, uh, Leonardo AI software type thing. Uh, these are just family videos. Beep, 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 beep. Oh, so this is a this was a still image of my two dogs. I created uh, this from photograph of my two dogs um, and uploaded that. And this is a similar one. So these were all animated with Kling AI, but uh, these were these were uh, still images that were generated and then uploaded. And I could show you. I think. Uh, chat GPT. Yeah, I could show you uh, as we wait for that. We, I could show you uh, image art practice. Okay, right to the top. So it was one of the first things I was doing was using this to create all the way to the top. So oh wait. Do, do, do. Star Wars, Star Wars, Star Wars, Star Wars, Star Wars, Star Wars. So, yeah, there you go. So, these are my dogs, uh, Tony and Bailey. And we went, uh, it was a Halloween thing at the local Humane Society, um, Lollipop Farm in Rochester, New York. And they have uh, Barktoberfest. They have the dogs dress up. So, we were had these pictures taken of them in Buffalo Bills jerseys because we live in upstate New York. And... Everybody loves Buffalo Bills everywhere, but especially. And then I said, uh, use this uploaded photo to create high quality 3D CGI illustration inspired by modern movies. So here's a couple pictures uh, that like it, it gets, it understands, you know, you can ask it. This was like the first couple times I was doing it, but uh, you can ask it for a description of what's in the image. Give me a description of the brown dog. Give me a description of the other dog. And it'll give you a text description. And it'll say, write a prompt for me on how to recreate um, that image in in this. All right? So this is where the images start getting better. So like I said, same, same pictures. And then, of course, I went to uh, this. Only eight minutes left. And I... Uh, and here we go. I uploaded uh, these pictures. So you, you saw you saw them in the other ones. Um, uploaded all these pictures. You could also see that if you upload a picture like like this, the animation isn't very good. There is a little bit of animation in here. But it's more of a, just like a zoom in, just zooms in. Same thing I got, I had to do this one twice because the original one, there isn't really much motion on there. It's just, it's just zooming in, you know? It just zooms in. And that's and that's no good. Same thing with this, with this picture. So sometimes you end up end up having it generate something you're using your credits and if you're doing it for free you're wasting three hours of your life and then the final product isn't much but you could just reiterate so so this one this one was it came out not so good the first time so i just did it a second time i had same image and now it has people uh moving around and doing things um but sometimes like with this one it really generates a very uh active kinematic uh, motion in these it's still generating this so we're going to come back to this i'm going to pause this here and then i'm going to show you the final product and then we'll be done it's all rendered so here's our final product thank you for watching this video tutorial on how to animate photos obviously that wasn't the best uh because it didn't make it blink or anything, but like I could re-render this until I get something that I like. But for these purposes, you see how to do what you need to do.